Hey guys, no budget RC back here with another budget build video for the SCX 10 2 Deadbolt. So, if you're familiar with the factory electronics in these, they come with a axial AE5 speed controller and then the axial 35 turn brushed motor. And these are fine, they'll get the job done. Um, but there's better out there. And obviously, with it being a budget build, I'm not going to go with some crazy brushless system. So what I've decided to go with is the Hobbywing 1080 ESC. I uh, actually did a review of this on my channel. You can go back and find that. But this has 15 adjustments that you can make on it, where the stock AE5, the only thing you can adjust is your drag brake, and then there's only a couple settings for that. Um, this has 15 things that you can change in there, 15 adjustments that you can make to dial it in the way you want it. And to pair with that, went with the Reedy 16 turn 5 slot armature motor. So the most brushed motors are 3 slot, and uh, being a five, 5 slot makes this motor a lot smoother on startup and smoother low end. And uh, I know you might be thinking 16 turn is pretty fast for a crawler, but really it's not because being that it's a five slot, really speed wise, this motor is going to fall in somewhere between a 27 turn and 35 turn of a three slot. So it's going to be pretty on par with what comes factory and the axial vehicles as far as speed. It's just going to be a lot smoother on the bottom end. So that's why I went with that. And then the other thing that I have here is what Axial calls silver, but they're uh, kind of a gray colored diff cover. And the reason I got those is because when you have an OD green vehicle with bright red diff covers, it just looks funny to me. I was just gonna dye the diff covers black, and then they really blend in with the axle and you kind of lose them, where most vehicles usually have like a chrome or an aluminum, you know, diff cover, so went ahead and picked these up and uh they were i think they were about 10 bucks got the uh, motor off of ebay for 27 bucks and got the esc off of hobby king for 38 bucks so that's where we're at on as far as on the budget um i think that this power system is definitely going to be a big improvement over stock and little the diff covers is definitely just going to give me a little better look. Um, if you guys have seen some of the other videos, these wheels were originally chrome, and I didn't like the chrome with the OD green, so I dyed them black, stripped the chrome off, and then used RIT dye to dye them black. So that's really about all I had in this video, guys. So thanks for watching, and we will catch you next time.